Hi. So I wanted to let you know how I'm doing on my New Year's opportunity. Try one new thing a week. For the first week, I did blind contouring, which is when you draw someone without looking at the paper. Week two, I tried bimimbap, a Korean rice dish. Delicious. Week three, I know this is kind of cheesy, but I woke up early to watch the sunrise. It was beautiful, and usually I'm a pretty heavy sleeper. Week four, I made homemade gifts for my friends for Valentine's Day. I'm going to show you how to make some gifts for your friends for Valentine's Day. Oh, but wait. First, I wanted to give a shout out to Superwoman and her hashtag girl love challenge. I raise my voice for ending girl on girl hate. What about you? Okay, now crafts. First, you start with a plain white shirt. And then a potato. Yep, a potato. Cut it in half, carve a heart, and that becomes your stamp. Then you take some fabric paint. It's easy to find, and you pour it into a plate. I like pink. Everyone knows pink is power. I also like blue. You take the raised part of the heart and place that carefully in the paint, and then you stamp in any pattern you like. Let it dry, and ta-da, a great gift. I believe in wearing my heart on my sleeve. <laughs> I know, that was a really corny joke. I made these shirts for my friends. We believe in expressing our emotions. The same trick works with making cards. You can use a potato, or for a more interesting stamp, you can use an old sponge. You can use any paper you want for this. Just fold it in the shape you want it. Cut the sponge into any shape you want. Heart, stars, smiley face. This time, use poster paint, also easy to find. Now lightly place your new stamp into the paint, and then carefully and lightly stamp your card to make cool patterns. This is what happens when you press too hard. Huh, this is actually pretty cool. I like it. So you can play with how hard you stamp because it'll create different designs. Finally, you let it dry and then write whatever you'd like on the inside. This is for Nikki because she's my bestie, along with Ken and Teresa. Life without friendship is like a sky without the sun. Happy Valentine's Day. Love, Barbie. Peace.